All right, cool. We are here. So the rules should just be double battle, battle tower rules. And let's just kind of see what we can make happen, right? So I'm expecting him to bring Hitmon top. Okay, no Hitmon top, so that's really good for me. Because he doesn't have Hitmon top, I'm going to be in a really good position here. He does have, obviously, the Morgrem, which I need to be on the lookout for. But I did just look up the Calc, and um, Helping Hand Dragon Energy will take out Dusknor in one hit if they don't have a Focus Sash. So I do have that going for me. And what am I going to want in the back? Um, Comfy is there for floral healing support. And Uniclus is a Chonkarella Chunky Fella. Is pretty good against a good bit of what they're using. Um, I, I kind of want to try it this time, just going for Reuniclus, and then maybe do Blastoise next time. However, what it really just hinges on is me, I think, getting rid of... me getting rid of Rillaboom. So, let's maybe try Blastoise the first time. And what I'm expecting is maybe like Rillaboom Grewer uh, Morgrem snart, start. Okay. Right, so I will have to use follow me. I just, you know, I'm just kind of accepting that at this point. Um, they probably have Rillaboom somewhere. Ooh, interesting. So Dragon Energy is actually not very effective on Jirachi. This is cool. I like what I'm seeing here. <laughs> this is cool. <laughs> oh, I love how it just does nothing. Um, so let's see. What do I need to do here? I think... I have to just follow me again and switch out Reggie Draco into Blastoise.
Okay. They do get a critical hit on Blastoise, which isn't great. Um, hmm. So let's see. I think I am just going to get the Shell Smash in. And just hit follow me. Or Let's just expanding force this turn. Actually, I think I should have... Yes, yeah, so he goes into the monk. As they say. Oh, and they're faster than me. That's really smart. So I'm going to have to adjust pretty heavily for this. Let's see. I want to see if if I use follow me. I want to see what's going to happen. But he is playing really well. He's playing really good. He's playing really good. Okay, so out comes Trick Room. Do we want to deny Trick Room? I mean, at this point, yeah. So let's just taunt and bring out Blastoise. That's damage. That is certainly damage. Okay. So... I kinda have to just floral healing this turn. And... Shell smash. And I'm not super happy about it, but I am going to do it. So I'm kind of expecting him to maybe want to poltergeist the Blastoise this turn. But you never know. Okay. So this is where it's going to get tricky. They have one more turn of light screen. They have one more turn of light screen. 
I can't protect Blastoise. Wait, how many turns of light screen do they have? Two. So... Let's... Let's just... Taunt the Jirachi this turn and use Water Spout. It's a good play, man. That's a good play. Good play alert. Someone knows how to make good play. <laughs> We're getting the beery buried again. So now we just drag in energy again, water spout again, hope that it does a lot of damage. So they keep up the icy wind, that's, you know, it's smart for sure. Okay, out comes Mr. Gorlem. Mr. Gorlem. So I switch into Indeedy and just use Water Spout again. Ooh, actually, that was a really bad play on my part. Um, That was an insanely bad play. Because now they will be able to get the grassy glide up. They go for light screen, that's smart. I'm actually really happy that the that they survived that. Because what it means is that now I can switch Reggie Draco back in and use Water Spout again. Smart, that's really smart. Wow, they're making this really difficult.
Well, they're going down from recoil damage. So, wow. Okay. They are faster. <laughs> Yo, this is actually going to get pretty wild. Yep. Yep, that's what I would do. So they will, I, I'll still be able to take them out. The problem is if he flinches me. Yep, so I lose. Oh, that hurts, dude. That hurts. <sighs> you have no idea how much that hurts, dude. I literally couldn't do anything about that. Like, <sighs> I couldn't do anything about that. I don't have a plan to get around that. They got the literal one entire thing they needed and they won, so. They had literally one win condition, and they got it. It's 30%. Right. So what do I lead now in that, like, to in response to that? Reuniclus and Didi with Zerud and Reggie Draco. It's the light screen really got me in that game and like. <sighs> yeah, well, they had to flinch and they did, so. Nothing I can do about that. Right. 
Right, so I'm going to have to be careful here. They should, okay. I was expecting them to maybe switch in Rillaboom. But they're just going to go for the light screen and probably like Trick Room. It's for Darkest Lariat. Doesn't do nothing, that's for sure. So let's get our Trick Room up because I will take Trick Room and just go for Follow Me. But losing Follow Me this early on is probably going to work against me if we're being honest. I would really like to get rid of Jirachi this turn, but I do feel like I need to go after... So if their Poltergeist can one-shot me, I think I'm just going to lose right off the bat. We do get solid damage there. I could have protected. That was a really bad play. Do I even have Protect on Reuniclus? I don't think I do. So, yeah, I'm going to lose this. <sighs> Just not. I didn't play it well. So, it's like, what, what do you expect from yourself? Like, what can I realistically do here? I can do nothing. I can protect. I could lock into dragon energy knowing that it's still going to probably be the best. No, I probably have to lock into dragon pulse, but it's... So we Ancient Power the Gorlam over here, and we just use Protect, I guess. Like, I'm going to lose, so it doesn't matter. They should just use, like, Dazzling Gleam and... Oh, and they have Reflect. Jeez. And they make the right decision, bro. You really make the right targeting decision. <laughs> and then I have absolutely no answer for this because it has U-turn, which I didn't think about in any way, shape, or form. So that's GG's. I clearly demonstrated this so well, so that's good. Mm, not without any little salt in the wound. We gotta add more salt to the wound.
that's going to help me unless trick room ends but i like i just can't do anything to get out of this yep trick room's going to end so i'm going to i'm, I'm going to lose anyways it doesn't matter like One shot. Yep. Oh, critical hit. Yeah, of course, because they really needed the critical. Yeah. So... Interestingly enough, Flareon is the one thing that I needed here and that, that I didn't bring. So that's fun. That's a lot of fun. So nothing you can do about that. That's the game. I lost. I played terrible. I didn't play the worst, but I definitely didn't play the best. So like, like what am I supposed to do against freaking double light screen yeah, I'm not even gonna sit here and complain about it. Like, obviously he beat me. Like, he played well. GG's. It's just, you know, like, there's literally nothing I can do about it. So, that's the game. Till the next one.